There's a total of 5 rarities for swords and block shoots. There are common swords, uncommon, rare, legendary, and mythic swords. And recently, I mastered every single mythical sword in the entire game. And there's a total of 5 mythical swords and block shoots, okay? We got a Hell Sight, we got a Curse of Katana, True Turbo Katana, Dark Blade, and a Triple Dark Blade. And so I made a little compilation for you guys to see how I obtain these swords and how I master them. Because some were pretty hard to get, alright? Now, like the video, sit back, and enjoy the video. Alright, guys, this is gonna be one of my most special videos on block shoots because as you know i'm trying to become the best the strongest alive in block shoots and as you know we've literally mastered and tested out every single fruit in the entire game and most of them i have permanent okay like literally like 95 percent and also we're doing the swords now but we're only missing like a few swords one of them being the strongest sword in the entire game which i have not done before and this sword has a special puzzle now it's not like the dark blade it's kind of different right the dark blade v3 is also super hard to get but in today's video we're gonna be mastering the cursed duo katana the sword is made out of the yama and the tushira sword two very cursed swords and block shoots and you also will need them to even get the cursed duo katana and this will make me officially the strongest person alive well kind of now first thing first maybe you guys already know this but i actually do already have the tushira sword all the way up to mastery 350 all right and i kind of don't know why i have this i did it a long time ago but you also will need 350 mastery on both swords yama and tushira to even start this puzzle and then we also have the yama sword right here and it also has above 350 mastery so we're pretty much ready to do the puzzle of the cursed duo katana now this puzzle can take hours upon hours this, this can literally take days but i'm gonna be attempting to do it within one try literally like in one go wish me luck now obviously guys this is one of the five mythical swords in block shoots and it's the only one that has a puzzle to obtain it and we're gonna get started with the puzzle also before i forget you have to be level 2200 to even start this quest now luckily i'm max level so that's gonna be no problem and also if you guys don't know how to get yama in order to obtain yama you have to talk to this guy over here the elite hunter this guy will send you up to kill 30 elite pirates and if i click on progress as you can see i have 60 of them defeated and i'm pretty sure you only need 30 of them to unlock the yama sword after you defeated all these elite pirates you have to go to the secret waterfall in hydra island and go through the secret door which is right over here and there will be a lot of ghosts over here they're trying to kill you as you can see the yama sword is right there in a stone you just have to pull it out after you kill all these ghosts hey don't kill me now what the heck get out of here wait the door is locked what the heck wait get me out of here now for the tushira sword you have to go over and summon rip indra while you summon trip indra right here with a god shellis you have to be quick and you have to go back to the same secret entrance you got the yama with but this time there's another secret passage that opens and let's get all these ghosts out of here and then when you go all the way up right here let's see is this open come on Oh, I don't think it's open. Oh, it's open. Okay. Now you're in a secret cave and then this door will be open if Rip Indra is spawned. And once you go through that, you have to light some torches at Turtle Island. And that's how you get to Shira. So yeah, it's kind of hard. Now after you've done all of that, you have to master both of these swords to 350 mastery. And then you can start getting the Curse Duel. And of course, we got Starveer, okay? And uh, uh, I already see that, man. I already see that. You got a Curse Duel. All right, buddy. I'm going to be getting that as well, okay? I'm going to become even more OP. Even though I only have one one sword right now which is pretty much the same sword look at that it, one of them is yama i don't know if you can see that but yeah right here you can see that yama and tushida both together forms the curse duo but now i'm gonna start a quest and i'm actually gonna get it you are never going to get it haha <laughs> bro what i'm gonna i'm gonna get it what what are you talking about i literally got every single sword so far like every mythic hollow sight true triple like you don't even have hollow sight like what are you even talking about you're just talking crap right but now come here and roll fruit okay because we still didn't roll fruit okay so let's go roll fruit let's see if luck is with us, I can actually go ahead and get this sword, okay? Please! Oh my- oh no, no, no! Alright, uh, I might not even get this sword today. This is bad. Alright, but now to start this quest, we're pretty much at a location, okay? We have to go to this tower behind the mansion. And I'm pretty sure on the left side, we will find an NPC. Oh, there he is. The Crypt Master. What is he about to say? Have you seen the entrance behind this building? It feels cursed. No, I haven't. I think you can handle it. I can open the way for you if you want. Uh, okay. It should be open now. Good luck in there. Um, alright. Thanks, I guess. At the back of this thing, where is this? Th oh, I see the- Oh my- Okay, um, let's go in, okay? Let's see. Oh, 
What is this place? Why is it filled with skeletons and some cursed like drawings? What is that? And wait a minute, I see a scroll right here and I see a scroll right here and I can interact with it. All right, here we go, guys. Oh, the Yama scroll. Pain and suffering, haze of misery and fear the reaper. First trial, pain and suffering. Um, now what? How do I even know? Wait, wait a minute, did these lanterns just turn red? Why are these? Oh, oh, this is the angel side and this is the evil side. It was like a spirit food room, to be honest. Now, apparently we have to have the Yama sword equipped for this and die to an npc like what i guess that's why it's called the haze of misery so uh mythological pirates you know you can just hit me apparently we just gotta get hits until we get some kind of fragment for sure it's called the alucard fragment it's like a red shard now i'm not getting anything so far do i have to die? <gasps> have to die wait maybe i have to hold the yama sword let's see oh there you go obtained the alucard fragment the scroll reacts to your achievements oh wait, wait wait do i have to go back now what the heck is this thing i guess one quest already completed and five more to go all right, we're back at the scroll. Let's see. Interact. Okay, so we just done a pain and suffering. Now, time to do a haze of misery. Okay, second trial. Haze of misery. Okay, what? Oh, why is everything foggy? What the heck? Wait, everything is foggy now. What the heck? What happens? Now, guys, I'm on the wiki, and it says the player vision will fog, and a purple marking will appear on a group of NPCs. The player will have to kill the group that has currently the marking. Interesting, so we have to find groups with purple markings. Once killed, the marking will be switched to that different one, and the player will have to kill these instead. This continues for a while and can take long until the fog stops. Wait, what? So we have to find purple NPCs or something? Are these? Oh, these have purple markings. What the heck? Come here, buddy. I need to kill you. Wait, and this guy doesn't? Wait. Uh, wait, this guy doesn't. Wait, what? Do I still have to kill this guy, though? Um, I have no clue. One of them had it. I'm not completely sure. Does this guy have it? This guy also doesn't have it. Wait, what? Was it just one NPC? All right, let's see. Oh, I see some purple markings. There you go. So all of them have the purple markings. So I guess I have to kill all of them and then go on to the next group, okay? So come here, buddy. Give me your purple marking, okay? It's like a purple thing. And when I kill them, it disappears. Um, wait, why does it disappear? Do I have to still kill all of them? This is so weird and so confusing. All right, that should be all of them. There you go. Everyone is dead. Okay, where are the pineapples? And these NPCs have it as well. What? Does just every NPC have it? I, I mean, I guess so. Easier for me. Okay, and these NPCs don't have a purple thing. Okay, so I don't kill these, I guess. Oh, and the fishmen have it also. Okay, so let's kill the fishmen. And that should be it for Turtle Island, maybe? I have no clue. I'm just killing all of them. There you go. I found some more at Hydra Island. Not all of the NPCs have the purple markings. Like, I have to find them, which is kind of annoying. I guess that's gonna slash them up really quick. And not every single one of them has them. Come here, buddy. Take some of this. There you go. And stop hiding, you stupid, okay? Let's get that one. This guy also has purple. Die. Every purple guy has to die. Die, okay? Here you go. Take some of this. And take some of this, okay? You're dead. Okay, this one doesn't have it. And this one also doesn't have it. This is so weird. Now, where do I go next? To these? Let's see. Do oh, these have it as well. Okay, die. Come on, there you go. You're dead. Okay, these one have it as well. Come on. Now you have to die as well. I'm about to hire bounty hunters to literally hunt them down, okay? Everyone with purple markings have to die. Take this and take this. You're dead. Oh, and these ghosts have it as well. What the heck? I did not expect that. I'm glad I checked here, okay? Come on, you go ahead and die real quick. Die. And these are all of them. Okay, one more. There you go. And that's all. Let's get out of here. Where's the next group? You all are going to die. Okay, I'm at Haunted and all of the skeletons at Haunted have it. Okay, okay. So I just gotta kill all of them. Buddha transform and come here, buddy. Let's lure all of them together and let's just uh, slaughter them, you know? And there you go. Everybody is dead. Okay, perfect. Wait, come on. Can I pray? Come on. Oh, nothing. Unlucky. Let's see. Do these have it? Okay, these don't have the purple markings. What the heck? And then these maybe? These also don't have it. Maybe downstairs? Okay, the downstairs ones have it. The possessed mummies. You're all going to die. Die. You're already a mummy, but you're gonna die again, okay? Take some of this, buddy. Yeah, take some of the god human, okay? Oh, I can even see through the walls who have the purple markings. Look at that. The living zombies, all of them have it. And look who we got here. The living zombies, all with a purple marking. You already know what's gonna happen to you, okay? Everyone is gonna die. Okay, you're gonna die, you're gonna die, and you're gonna die. Just like that. And everybody's dead. Now, on to the next one. At the grade three, and everybody has a purple marking, okay? Perfect. And it's still so foggy, bro. The fog is making me crazy, bro. Get the fog out of here. I don't want it to be foggy anymore, man. Come on, die so the fog can disappear, please. Oh, there you go. All the card fragment. Okay, we've gotten all of them. There we go. Finally. Oh my god, that took a while. And I didn't even go through all of the islands, so that's kind of weird. But I will take that, alright? Alright, let's go back to this cursed place. Let's see what is next. Okay, let's see. Yama scroll. Okay, the next one is Fear the Reaper. Third trial. Now, what do we do? Wait, how does anyone figure this out on his own? Like, how do you know what Fear the Reaper is? Like, what? How do you do this without an explanation? Like, bro, there's no way someone did this without an explanation. Like, I don't believe it. But apparently, 
Thirdly, we have to spawn in a Soul Reaper and then get killed by it. And then we get teleported into a place called Hell. Like, bro, what? Yeah, this is getting more interesting and more interesting. But we have to go to this Death King NPC to roll some spins, okay? Because this guy will give us a Hollow Essence to spawn the boss in. And look at that! First try. This was my first roll. I, I what? Um, I, I'll take that. I, I guess yeah, I've been saving up bones for this. Like, don't get me wrong. Look at this, four thousand bones. Cause I knew this was gonna take a while, but I guess I got lucky, dude. I've never gotten this lucky before. I'll take it. Wait, wait. I don't even know what I'm doing. Let's go back and spawn the boss. Okay, there you go. Spawn it in. An unknown being has entered this world, and now let's go die to the boss. Yeah, for the first time, I'm not gonna kill you. Okay, you can kill me. Okay, yeah. Just slash me up, alright? Yeah. Just, just do it, okay? I'll accept my fate, okay? I'll accept it. Loading. What the heck happened? And now he's... Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, what is this? Hell dimension? Bro, uh, where am I? And why can't I see a single thing? Like, why is it so dark? Uh, and now I have to find torches, it seems like. Light torch? Let's see. What does this do? Oh. Oh, buddy. Okay. Okay, chill. What did I do? Did I... I just light the torch. Are you after me? Okay, I guess if you're after me, I have no choice but to defeat you, okay? Come here, buddy. You are nothing, okay? You are literally nothing. I'm gonna slash you up like that. There you go. And you are dead, okay? Um, yeah, that wasn't even a challenge. Where's the next one? Okay, wait. Oh, these are hidden in, like, the rocks. They're camouflaged, and it's so dark, so I can barely see that, okay? Let's light them as well. Okay, now you didn't get me. I'm fully alert, okay? I'm gonna be slashing you up, and I'm gonna be getting the curse duo katana, okay? People are doubting me, but I'm gonna get it, okay? Now you're all gonna be dead like that, and where's the last one? Because I really can't find it. Maybe right behind here? No. Wait, does this lava damage me? Okay, this lava luckily doesn't damage me. Wait, where's this last one? I can't find it. Um, guys, where do you find the last one? Wh where is it? No, no, I actually can't find it. Wh where's, where the heck is this thing? Um, oh, I find it. What the heck? Okay, this one was crazy. I couldn't find this one, okay? Spawn it in. Okay, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying. I'm dying, I'm dying. No, no, no. Oh my god. Oh, I almost died. Just because they caught me off guard, okay? But now you're all gonna die, okay? Now you're all gonna die, okay? Let me heal up. Let me do that. And you're all gonna be dead, all right? Wait, there's one tanky one. What the heck is that? Wait, who is this guy? Um, apparently this guy has Dark Blade V2. Okay, I gotta be careful. I gotta be careful, okay? Let me slash this guy out like that. Come on. V4 transform. Yeah, buddy, you're gonna have it easy, okay? Take some of this, and take some of that. And now literally die. Just like that, okay? You're dead. And now, oh, the portal has opened. And now we just gotta go through this portal, and let's see. Oh, there you go. A Lucard fragment has been obtained. The scroll reacts to your achievements. And that is the third fragment. Now let's go back to the scroll, because what's gonna happen now? Interact, let's see. The scroll bursts into flames and disappears. Wait, it disappeared. What? Uh, is that supposed to happen? Um, Please tell me so, okay? There you go. And now we have another scroll, which is the two Shida scroll, right? Yeah. Dog, Legend, Sense of Duty, and Soulless. All right, let's go and start this one as well. First trial. Dog, Legend? What is that supposed to mean? All right, Dog, Legend is talk to three different boat dealers in three different islands and select Pardon Me. And on the last page of the boats. Oh, easy. Don't have to ask me twice. And I'm pretty sure there's one on the turtle entrance, okay? Am I right? Yes, there's a boat dealer over here. Okay, let's see. Is it this one? Let's see. Next. Next. Oh, pardon me. Okay, let's see. Boom. Hey, traveler, I recognize you. It's pleasant to see a familiar face around here. Yay, what's up, buddy? Okay, that was one. Now, maybe Cakeland has one? I'm pretty sure it does, right? Yeah, there you go. Next, next, next. And there you go. Pardon me, okay? Let's see. Another one. All right, there you go. That's two. Let's see. Let's go portal now. That's the block tree dealer. Now, here's the luxury boat dealer. Next, next, and pardon me. And boom. All card fragment update. Wait, bro. Curse duel is easy so far. I already have four fragments. Is this a joke to you guys? <laughs> like, what? So far, I'm getting the curse duel within five minutes, okay? So, watch me, all right? All right, next trial, come at me, bro. Okay, second trial, there you go. Sense of duty, bro. How does anyone figure this out without an explanation? Like, sense of duty, what does that even mean? Maybe Dark Legend, I would understand. What is sense of duty? Oh, apparently it's kill a pirate in a pirate raid in the castle on the sea. Oh, well, I mean, how do I even spawn a pirate raid? I, I can't, I, I literally can't. So now I just gotta wait until a pirate raid comes and I can actually defeat it. Oh, man. I guess this is the hardest one so far, just waiting for a pirate raid raid. What? Okay, not really. The purple ones were a little harder because of the fog, okay? But now, I guess we just wait. Oh, and guys, while waiting, I just realized, look at this. Alucard fragment. It's kind of like the dark fragment and mirror fractal, but it's a, like a red shard.
start and I have four of them. So two more to go and I have enough for the cursed duo katana. Not too bad. Now this is one of my biggest videos so far. So if you guys want any of these perm fruits on the screen, make sure you like the video, subscribe and let me know which one is your favorite. I'm gonna choose one winner for this video. Now I'm gonna be um waiting, I guess. Oh, a block tree has spawned in the game. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, guys, I'm waiting and I literally noticed that. Okay, yes, yes, okay. Where is this thing? I'm pretty sure it's Sport Town. Um, it is, okay. Please be a mythical fruit. I haven't found a mythical fruit in ages, okay? Please. Uh what? I literally rolled a chop fruit in the beginning of the video. Bro, I am cursed. Throw this in the ocean. I don't want to see this fruit anymore. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. Throw it. Throw it. Get away! I hope it never comes back, bro. Oh, the pirates have been spotted approaching the castle. Okay, it's finding time. It's finding time. One of the last quests to unlocking the best sword in the entire game. Okay, they're raiding the castle now. Let's see. Come on. Okay, how many do I have to kill? Do I have just to kill one? Just like that? Okay, no, definitely not. I probably have to kill the last pirate. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's the guy. All right, come here, buddy. Take some of my god human. Just like that. Just like this. And you're gonna be dead. Three, two, one. Boom. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Alucard fragment obtained. And we got a key kilo fruit. Okay, yeah, that's that's cool, man. That's cool. What is this curse? Get me out of here. Right, now we're going back to the secret place just to finish this quest off, all right? All right, let's see. Interact. And the last one is soulless. So let's see. Third trial, soulless. All right, there you go. Now that's going to be the last one. So we can obtain six Alucard fragments to obtain the curse duo. Okay, I, I, I don't see a curse duo around here, but let's go and do this last quest. Dang, apparently for this one, we have to kill K-Queen in under two minutes. And after we punch K queen for the first time, a song is gonna play. And then we'll have two minutes to defeat her. What's the best sword to do it with? Okay, let's see. I'm pretty sure my Dark Blade has insane damage. All right, so I'm equipping Dark Blade, Pal Scarf. Let's see. All right, K queen, you're dead, okay? Okay, let's get started. Oh, I heard a song. I heard a song. Okay, come on. We have to be fast. We have to be fast, okay? Wait, I don't have points on sword. I don't have points on sword. Oh my, I just realized. I just realized I don't have points on sword. Oh my. No, this is so stupid. This is so stupid. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna get it. I'm not gonna get it. No. I forgot. Oh my god, look at the fighting style glitch. What the heck? I have like crazy aura. Oh my god, okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Probably like one more minute. Come on, we have to do this. We have to do this. Come on, come on, come on. All right, she's getting low. She's getting low. Okay, queen, come on. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. No. How does she hit me? Come on. Please, faster. Come on, no. Are we gonna be on time? I don't know. I don't know. Come on. No. Why do you dog back me so much? Come on, please. 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 Come on. Am I on time? I still heard the song. I still heard the song. Oh. Can we do it? Oh, loading. Okay, okay, okay. What is this heavenly dimension? Wait, so first we were in hell and now we're in heaven. Oh my god. So this is what heaven looks like? Amazing. Okay, where's the torches? Okay, so we have to find torches again. Uh, I don't see any. Oh, I found one. Okay, there we go. Light torch. And now dash back. Okay, yeah, I already know what's going on here. You guys trying to ambush me, right? Well, there's no problem for me, okay? Let me dash you and slash you up. Ha, <laughs> rookie skeletons, right? And now we have to find two more torches. Okay, where do we find these? Can they be somewhere around here? They're usually on like rocks, right? I don't see maybe in the plant here. I don't I don't see anything over here. Let's see. Oh, I found another one. Okay, there you go. Light the torch. Dash back. Yeah, I already know what you guys are planning. We're about to unlock the curse duo. Okay, come on, come on. This is gonna be the last one. Okay, there you go. All of them are dead. And now the last torch is hey, right over here. I found it. I'll light it up and uh what the heck? Is there like a light boss or oh there's a boss? What the heck? Okay, let's get everyone. How does this boss look like? Let's see. Oh, what is that? Does he have angel v4? Oh, he doesn't even have angel. Does he? Wait, what? What are these wings? Angel v5? Oh, I'm getting smashed. I'm getting smashed. Okay, wait. Angel, I'm sorry, buddy, but you're gonna die, okay? You're gonna die. Bro, he's doing no damage. Bro, he's doing moves, but he's doing absolutely no damage, bruh. Is this really what Curse Duel is? Like, these bosses are not even doing damage. You made me slash it, dash it up. Ugh, come on. There you go. Die, and he's about to die. It looks pretty good, though, you know, with the angel thing, with the flying... Okay, anyway. Hey. Oh. Why did it look like I died? <gasps> what? Okay, that was really weird, but the heavenly portal opens, and we're going to heaven... Finally, and there you go, obtained Alucard Fragment. That is gonna be the last one. And now, what do we do now? Let's see, talk to the scroll. Oh, it disappears, okay. It bursts into flames and disappears. And now what? Wait, do I have to go to this thing? Oh, oh, there's a parasol. Okay, interact. Question mark, question mark, question mark. The six shards of the legendary Alucard. Oh, Fragment react to the each. Oh, what is happening? Uh, the door is opening. What is this? Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm locked, I'm locked. I'm locked with this cursed skeleton boss. What is this guy doing? Oh, it looks like he has the cursed duo. So I guess we have to beat this guy to get the cursed duo. Hey, bad. Say no more. <gasps> 
Oh, wait, he's immune. Um, wait, let me try again. Wait, I can't hit him. What the heck? I definitely have my aura activated. Why can I hit this guy? Activate your aura ability to deal damage. Bro, I have it activated. Uh, is this bugged, guys? I don't even understand what's happening. Why can I hit this guy? Oh, what? I've officially bugged the game. I don't know what's going on. Come on. Maybe even Buddha transformation. Let's see. I still can't hit this guy. Um, guys, maybe if I turn my hockey off, let's see. Can I hit this guy now? I still can't hit this guy. Um, what? Why can't I hit it? Okay, guys, it's bugged. It's bu it literally bugged. Do I have to just die to this guy? Like, all this work for nothing? All this work to just die and not get a curse duo? What? No, no, but like, seriously, I, I can't hit him. I, I like, literally can't hit him. I, I guess we die? Like, what? I, I, I guess we, we die. Wait, but can I even still get it? No, 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 don't tell me, don't tell me. Come on, get up, get up, get up, quick, quick, quick. Let's see, come on. Oh, can we just refight him? Oh, we can. Okay, perfect. Now, hockey enable, and let's see. Oh. Uh, I, I still can't damage him. Uh, I still can't damage him. Uh, I guess let's die again. Uh, I mean, I, I literally can't damage him. Like, oh, guys. Oh, oh, oh. I did not read one thing, okay? But who, who knows this? Who knows this? You have to kill the boss with Tushita or Yama. Otherwise, it takes no damage. But why does it say that I need hockey on? Like, it doesn't make sense. Anyway, let's go and spawn it in once again. Open the door and it's open. And now I can damage him. Let's see. Oh. Now I can damage him. But it doesn't say. Like, look, if you hit him, it just says it's immune to physical attacks, which is not the case. So, in my opinion, this should be changed. Like, the error message. Because it's not clear what you're doing wrong. But anyway, I guess I found out what's going on. And now I just gotta slash him and dash him. And then we're getting the curse duel. Come on. Alright, come here, buddy. You are nothing, okay? This Sushida sword is gonna slash you, dash you. Take some of this. There you go. And the skeleton is gonna be dead within a second, all right? This is one of the strongest bosses, I guess, because it has the curse duel. I'm gonna take that curse duel, and it's gonna be mine. So die, and he's... Oh, look at my sword. What the heck just happened to... Oh, oh my god. Obtained the cursed duel katana. Oh my god. And what is this cursed skeleton doing over here? What do you think you are, buddy? Oh, I'm fighting with a cursed duel. Oh my god. Yo! Yo, what are these cursed skeletons doing here? Oh my god. Yo, chill. Chill, buddy. I'm gonna slash you guys all up, all right? Yeah, take some- Oh, they're tanky. Why are they so tanky? Uh, guys, I have a problem over here. Wait, can he- Can he even hit me? Oh, oh, they can, they can, they can, they can. Chill, 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 chill. Wait, wait, wait. Go before? Come on. Can I even defeat these guys? Like, what? Everybody die. Wait, I'm not getting any mastery by this. What? Wait. They're infinitely spawning. I, I need to get away. I need to get away. Yo, yo, yo. Get me out of here. They're infinitely spawning. All right, there you go. Oh my god. Look at that. The cursed duo katana. I unlocked it. Oh my god. After so long. Okay, let, look at that. Cursed duo katana. Wait a minute. Why is it not next to my mythical swords? Ah, I have to upgrade his sword. Yes, that's what we also gotta do. And oh, oh, look at this. Look at the aura. I feel so powerful already. But we will have to unlock both abilities, okay? Revolver Ravager and Slayer of Goliath, which is the 375? That is so much mastery! Oh my god, that's gonna take so long again! And look who is here! Look look at my swords, buddy! I got the curse duo, okay? You were doubting me, you were doubting me, okay? You said I wasn't capable of getting it. How? Well, easy job, bro. I, I got it in like two hours or something. So fast? Yeah, right? I got it in like less than two hours. It was crazy. I got a hollow essence first try. That's right. Oh, huh? yeah, that's right, buddy. Uh, but anyway, we have to master this sword, all right? And check the damage. Oh, you already probably know the damage, but I don't know the damage. Oh, oh look at these slashes. They look sick. You need to buy a lottery ticket. Uh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> you're right, to be honest. Getting Hollow Essence first try is crazy luck. But let me roll a fruit real quick, because I can probably roll one already, okay? It's been a while, okay? It's been a minute. Let's see. Can I roll fruits? And I can, and, and, uh... Uh, uh, here, take that, take that, take that. I don't want that! There's a second kilo fruit I got today, bro. I swear, if you got a kilo fruit as well... Oh! No, 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 drop it. Oh, oh you drop... Hey! Yo! Get a Buddha fruit, yo! Oh my god, look at that. No Buddha fruit, bro! That is insane! Anyway, let's go ahead and check the damage. Because I'm excited, right? This is supposed to be the best sword in the entire game. I cannot store it. You have it. Um, yeah, sure, I have enough storage. I can I can store it. Why not, man? Here, store that real quick. There you go. Don't mind if I do. But let me equip Pal Scarf and let's check the damage, right? 3, 2, 1, and go. 
2.6k with a level 1 mastery. That is some pretty good damage. I'm not gonna lie. But I wanna have more damage, right? So blacksmith upgrade the best sword of the game. How much is this gonna cost? Oh, uh, 6. Okay, enough. And I need 4 of these too. What are these two? Like, um, how do I get these? And it only gives me a 7% damage increase? That is very little. But we have to get it, alright? Now, where do I even get teeth? Like, um, what? But these mythological pirates give the teeth. I have to fight these. Let's see. Wait, 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 wait. I need to try it. How does Curse Duel look with the Buddha glitch. Let's see. Oh my god. No. The curse swords with the Buddha glitch. This looks insane. Yo, this is the sickest it will look. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, let's slash him up and we can also get some mastery. Okay, okay. But the main objective is these teeth. All right. So give me that. Give me that. For sure there's more over here. There you go. Dude, I feel so powerful. Oh, and we got a new skill available. Wait. Oh, we already got enough. By just killing these, like I'm trying to get these teeth. These materials. I, I guess I can get that. Let's go use the ability. Let's see what the damage is like. Okay, let's see. Three, two, one, and... Oh my god. Oh my... Show! 5.7k damage. 5.7 thousand damage. And that was Revolving Ravager. Oh my god. Tap it? Wait, tap it? Oh, like what? Okay, let's see. I, I hold it in. Yeah, okay, let's see. Tap it. That was kind of the same thing, but then less damage, I guess. Only if I, like, do it next to you like that, you get damage, you see? But other than that, it's pretty much the same thing. Okay, that damage is insane, though. I cannot wait for Slayer of Galia to unlock the full potential and upgrade the sword to max level. First, I need the materials to upgrade the sword, okay? So, pirates, give me some materials, all right? Stop stalling already. All right, and there you go. Obtain mini tusk. That's the last one. All right, so now we can go back and upgrade the sword. And uh, where is Stardew? What the heck did you just get? Is that a new fighting style? What the heck? Oh my god. That looks insane. Zeus race V4? Bro, bro, what? That's not Zeus. What? All right, anyway, let's go on and go over here to Port Town because we need to upgrade our curse door, right? There's no time for stalling. Let's go to the blacksmith and let's upgrade the sword for max potential. Look at that. We got that. We got that. We got that. Craft. All right, there you go. We just upgraded it. Oh my god. And now it should be next to my other mythical swords. Let's see. Yeah, look at that. These are all in a row. That looks so nice. Now, let's see how much damage it does. All right, let's see, let's see. One stash did 2.6k. Now it does... 3k? Yo, it's already getting super high, even though we still need to master this up, all right? So, uh, I also want to try this Z ability once again. Let's see. What if I just use it right here? Come on. How much damage? 6.2k. What? Half of your HP is gone by one attack? Like, what? But I'm curious. Do you get stunned? Yes? Wait, really? So if I use it, you, you have no... Oh, I can't escape. Oh my, yo, that is insane. All right, so now I gotta get 375 mastery, which that's a lot, all right? How do people even get that on this sword? I mean, this sword is insane, though. Let's go teleport to turtle entrance, because we need to fight somebody. And I'm gonna be speeding this up, because this is gonna take a while. All right, what's good, Longma? This is one of my new swords, okay? You're about to die, okay? You're Okay, look at that. Look at that damage. Look at that damage, all right? That's not gonna help much, because you're already dead. Now we go to Big Mom to do it all over again, until we get 375 mastery. All right, kick is all the way low and uh, she's dead. All right. And Longma, go ahead and die again, just like that. And now we go back to Big Mom. And K-Queen, let me slash up like that. Look at that combo. Oh my god. 200k, 250k damage. Oh my god, bro. And go ahead and die. All right, so we got up to 350 mastery, like 20 more to go for the ability. 366 mastery, that means nine more mastery. And Longma, you're about to die, buddy. You're about to die, buddy. Yeah, take my curse duel. Katanas, all right? Take some of this. There you go. And let me slash up like that. Okay, five more mastery to go. And we'll finally have it, right? The maxed out Curse Duo Katana. So, K-Queen, you're the last person that can actually give me this mastery. So, come here, K-Queen. Come on. Let me slash you up with the Curse Duo. This sword is the best. I'm telling you guys, this is, there's no better sword than this. Like, bro, what other sword can do this? Super fast slashing with high damage. Plus, your ability is like stun the enemy and do crazy damage. And I still haven't unlocked the last one, okay? Imagine. And now, we're about to unlock it. Come on. Come on. Let's go. New skill available. We just unlocked Slayer of Galia. Oh my god, okay, I need to try this. Where's Star at? All right, here we are. Star, are you ready? I have mastered the Curse Duo Katana. Up to 375, and now I can use this ability, okay? So, uh, let's see it, all right? Three, two, one, and... Oh my god. And now, I slash. Oh my... Wait, why am I all the way here? Uh, what was that? Let's see. Oh... Yo, what? Why was there a chain on my screen? What the heck? Wait, what if I tap it? What if I tap it? Let's see. Oh, okay, okay. That is such a quick ability and it does 5k damage. Not too bad. So imagine from here, like from far range like that, I charge up and I... 
Oh, this has crazy range. 6k damage? Okay, that's insane. Okay, yeah, this is super high damage. And why does one of my swords not have the, uh, the aura? What? what? These swords look insane. Look at the red aura. This is one of the best looking swords ever. I mean, maybe the dark blade is competing, but still. I want to see how much this ability does. Let's see. Let's see. How much does it do? After having all this mastery? 6.5 thousand. Okay, yeah, this is the highest damage ever. For a sword, that is insane. You have fast and one clicks, you have high damage, and you have a crazy bounty hunting ability, okay? The X one, you can go really far with this, and nobody will expect it. So I guess that was the Kurzuo Katana puzzle. This is the best sword inside of the game. Maybe it's gonna change soon, okay? Who knows? The Dark Blade, also known as the Yoru. It is a crucial sword to have in Blocks Roots because of its abilities and powers. Now, this sword has two versions, the V2 and the V3. And I decided that I need to unlock the full powers of the Dark Blade. So I upgraded this sword to V2 and V3 in one video. And also, this sword is used by the developer of the game, Rip Indra, which is also a boss in the game. So pretty much, becoming the strongest person in block shoots in this video. If you haven't already, drop a like right now, subscribe, and let's get on with the video. All right, guys, in today's block shoots video, we are going to be going on a quest to become one of the most strongest person in the entire block shoot world. And you guys already know who that person is. It's Rip Indra, okay? Today, we're becoming Rip Indra and awakening Dark Blade V2. Yes, that's exactly what I said, okay? This Dark Blade is gonna get a nice upgrade. Some visual effects are gonna change, but the most most important thing, we are gonna become a Rip Indra, okay? Now, you may say, how, how are we gonna become a Rip Indra, okay? Sir, that doesn't make sense, okay? Well, if I unequip my Pulse Curve, you guys can see that I actually do have a real Valkyrie, right? Now, technically, you can fake this because a Valkyrie Helm is also available f as an accessory. Oh, wait a minute. I just equipped a Valkyrie on a Valkyrie. Wait, wait. Is that even... Wait. That's possible? Wait, I have two Valkyries on right now. What the? Uh, okay, that's kind of weird. But the goal is whenever I awaken this Dark Blade V2, I can change my clothes into the exact Rip Indra clothes and become the true Rip Indra or like the, the, the yeah, the strongest person, right? You guys know where I'm going, okay? And guys, the first step we have already completed, right? As you guys can see, we have Dark Blade V1. That means I just bought it, right? Yeah, you, you have to buy the Dark Blade first. Now guys, the second step is we actually have to go back to C1 and that's not C1. Dude, I always forget which dogs it is, okay? There's a bunch of dogs. Okay, yeah, we're next to it, okay? I'm just gonna walk, okay? All right, Sea Captain, I have some business in C1, okay? Take me there. Now, if you haven't already noticed, okay, yeah, we're doing this uh, alone, okay? Yeah, Star isn't here, okay? No, but nobody's doing it with me, okay? So, we gotta go on this quest completely alone. Now, that's no problem for me, because I do have portal fruit, which I can teleport everywhere I want. And all I know is for step two, we gotta go to Middle Town. We gotta talk to a special person over here. This person is located at some of these houses. I think it was... Was it this one? Oh, it was this one. Okay, so, whoa. Have you guys no, no, this is like an admin room, as you can see. Like, we have a, whatever that is, like a FIFA card or something. We have the develop. What is, what even is that? You know what? I'm not gonna ask questions, okay? It, let them be, okay? Let's see. Robot Mega, that's the NPC we gotta have. Say it and say it well, okay? I, I say what? What do you need, bro? Respect me well. X? X? Bro. Bro, oh my god, oh my god, I sure respect you well, bro. You have earned all my respect for reaching level 350. Well, I'm a little higher than that, but okay. Yo, bro, can you help me with a quest, please? Fast. Uh, bro, what is happening? Okay, K? Yo, bro, have you seen my son Indra? He escaped yesterday when I caught him cheating with my homie, my game 43 Please help me capture him, bro. What? What is this crime? Bro, for sure, G. Hey, hey, for sure, G, man. I'll, I'll do it, all right? All right, that was a weird conversation. Why was it such a weird English? Okay, I, I don't even care. For the next one, we have to go to Snow Village, okay? So we got snow, so we got to teleport over here. Now, apparently, his son Indra is right over here. And I got to catch him because he escaped. So, hey, where are you, Indra? I'm coming for you. Is this Indra? Sick man. That's not Indra. That's a sick man. Okay, uh, I'm, my bad. Okay, that was the right one. Maybe the next house? No, I don't think so. What is this doghouse? Oh, it says Indra. I found you. Now, why is it a doghouse? Is, is it a dog? Wait, is Indra a dog? Okay, you know what? Bro, I'm so confused, right? Let's see. Hi, bro. Can I have 97 Robux? Uh... Yeah, sure, bro. I mean, why, hey, why not? Haha, <laughs> mentality of a child. I scanned you like a noob. Bro, what do you mean mentality of a child? Bro, I didn't even give him anything. Like, Huh. He's acting very tough, but okay, maybe say me why? Bro, what is this? I hate you, but if you say no, but if you say okay, and you give me we be friend. Wait, bro, 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 my head is exploding. What am I reading? Okay, now we have four say no, give nothing, reset. Right, this quest turned out to be a little weird. What is happening? Okay, four say no, uh, foretell bye, don't talk me again. Oh, bro, bro. It's like I'm talking to a one-year-old. What, what's going on? I didn't even learn to talk. Okay, let's see. Maybe you're, I don't know, who you... Bro, bro, what? You don't see that why I don't talk you so much. K, 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 bye. I don't ever talk you again. You know what? K, 
I don't care, okay? Yeah, there you go. You will never see me again, and I'm block you. Bro, he's blocking me now? What? Yo, cha -cha -cha, I need the dark blade V2, okay? Oh, wait a minute. It's been a while. I think I know how, okay? So, say me why first, then resay. Then say me why. Give nothing, then give good. Oh my god, yo, bro, our friend with master robot. Yes, yes, okay? Oh my god, can you say him to forgive me, please? Bro, no, I'm here to catch you, right? No. I have said my game is my master, but I lie for I get unbanned in blocks roots after using auto farm hack. Bro, Indra has been using hacks? Whoa, yo, yo, this kid, hey, this is going wrong, bro. What's going on? Okay, oh my god. Thanks, bro. Go find my love letters and expose them to my master, please. Sun quest started. All right, so now we gotta find the love letters to do this quest, which is a sun quest. I can't believe Indra's been cheating, bro. What? Can't believe it, man. Can't believe it. <sighs> Such a disappointment. But guys, basically what we did right now is talk to this guy named Indra, and he told us pretty much find love letters. Now, if you have the understanding of a one-year-old, you can probably like find out what he's talking about and see the locations, but I had no clue what he was saying. So I had to look at what's going on. And apparently there's a hidden secret door on this exact island the snow island and there's apparently a hidden door that you can only open with the dark blade so where's this hidden door obviously we got a cave over here which isn't a secret i'm pretty sure it was on this side of the island okay there's like this door that you can open with an ability maybe here okay no that definitely isn't it maybe somewhere here or something like it should be visible right so let's see i'm scanning oh Oh, there it is. And then apparently all we have to do is... Okay, we can't stash it. Ability. And it's open, okay? And look what we find inside. It's a love letter, okay? Yo, bro. When I say my game 43, master of me, it forget unban. Not, bro. I cannot read this. Not for him. Be my real master. Only you, my master. You, my master. Forever, bro. Uh... Lo okay, let's just, uh, hey, love letter one acquired. Okay, thank you, thank you. I don't want to hear that anymore, man. I'm losing brain cells by the second. Get me out of here, man. But now, apparently, we have to get two more love letters. So, one of them is apparently here at Sky Island. And here is supposedly a... Oh, yeah, this one, right? Yeah, so this is a door. I'm pretty sure that's the right one. Wait, I just go and sneak inside and... There you go. I already see it. But wait, can we literally flash tap inside? Yo! Um, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, I'm doing the quest legitimate, gu uh, guys, yeah, uh, yeah, don't look at this. All right, fast, fast, let's grab this, okay, four master, okay? Okay, to be honest, guys, I don't wanna read this, okay, bro? This score again, please, bro, I was, uh, okay, no, no, okay, low, okay, okay next, next, okay, love letter to acquire, okay, there you go, finally, bro, thank god, thank god, okay, get me out of here, okay, we got a second one, please, get me out of here. All right, one more love letter, and apparently this next one is at Marine Fortress, so let's go over here. Uh, it's been a while since I've been here, but apparently there's a hidden secret door around this island that allows you to go into a maze. Now, I heard it's at the back of the island, so I'm gonna just gonna, you know, check it up real quick. I feel like I've been here once. Uh, oh, I already found it, okay. And all we have to do, slash it up, and what is this place? Okay, so we gotta slash it up, okay, let's see. Slash it up, all right, and okay, let's go right, okay? Oh, so we can only slash it up with Z, okay, I get it, I get it, okay? Let's use Z again, there you go. Uh, I hope I'm going to good direction. All right, slash it up one more time. Uh, more doors, okay, left or right? You know what, right, okay, let's see, come on. Uh, I, I didn't mean to do that. I, I mean, uh, oh, there was nothing here. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Okay, nothing here. Okay, so it has to be here. All right, let's see. Come on, slash it open. And oh, there you go. Let's go. We got the love letter number three for master. I'll give it one more try. Okay, oh my god, you know well. I hate Wenlock. Don't interfere the son of Virtus' son. Sorry, guys, I can barely read this. Okay, yes, master. I have respect, but don't try to surpass my limiter. Whatever that means. Okay, love letter three acquired. Okay, perfect. There you go. Uh, now get me out of here. Ugh. There's, is there no shortcut? Okay, bro. I have to slash everything. Oh, okay, there you go. Luckily, go V3 makes me reload faster. There you go. And we're done with this maze. All right, now we're done with that. We have to go to Middletown back at it again. Now, apparently, if we go back to Robot Mega, we can awaken our Dark Blade. And before I do that, let's take a look at the abilities, okay? Let's see. So we got Z, which is a bunch of slashes. Then we got X, which is a big slash. All right, let's awaken it. All right, Robot Mega, I've done all your quests. Say it and say it well. I say, something weird has occurred to your Dark Blade. Ooh, okay, wait, wait, wait. Cry, cry, cry. My son still loves me. Thanks, bro. You're a real G. You have 100% my respect now, and I have hacked your dark blade. Go see. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. If you need anything, just tell me. No shame. You know well. That's what homies are for. Hey, okay, okay. So we just became best friends with this robot mega guy. I'll take that. I'll take that. We got some admin connections now, but now let's go and see, all right? What's different about this blade? Is it the flames? Because I don't see really much difference, to be honest. But I know for sure there's abilities that change, okay? So let's go and try Z right now. All right, let's see. Oh, it charge up right now, okay? Oh my, oh, I, I dash now, wait a minute. All right, so now we slash and dash at the same time, which is pretty cool. When oh, the X1 loads up as well, and, oh my, 
Bro, it's way faster and it goes way further. Now, I didn't check the damages, all right? But let's go and test it on a monkey right here. Let's see. So what if I test it on monkey? I charge it up and come here, monkey. Ooh, yeah, I raced him. What do you guys think? Darby V2 is a upgrade worth getting because you're not getting really a visual change. The abilities just change a little bit and... Yeah, they're pretty sick. Most of the people say it's not really worth it, but if you have Dark Blade V2, you can get Dark Blade V3. But since you are weakened this Dark Blade, we can change into Rip Indra. Now, as you can see, this is Rip Indra, okay? He's in the game, and this is what I need to look like. Meet the one and only Rip Indra. All right, I know what you might be thinking. Um, what are these go horns? I mean, hey, just just ignore it, okay? We officially became Rip. Indra in Blocks Roots. And bro, this looks sick, okay? It's like I'm a developer of the game. And now it's time to get V3. Blocks Roots video. Where in today's video, I'm gonna be doing the impossible, okay? Something that has been done by a few people, right? Not many. So in today's video, we're gonna become one of the strongest people alive by awakening Dark Blade V3. <sighs> yes, I said it, all right? You guys seem to really want this Dark Blade V3, okay? I've seen comments, a like hundreds of comments, okay? Asking for Dark Blade V3. Please do Dark Blade V3. Okay, please do it. Well, guess what? In today's video, I'm gonna be getting a Dark Blade V3. No joke. And as you can see, we have Dark Blade V2 in my hand, okay? It's the V2 version. You can't really see that, but it is V2, okay? Yeah, you guys know that I did Dark Blade V2, okay? So we have this upgrade abilities. These boom we can slash or we can dash and slash i guess right and then this one is much like larger and goes further pretty cool but now it's time to awaken this dark blade v3 oh there are the effects there you go so it's green right now apparently guys something very much changes about the sword okay i'm pretty sure it changes colors or something like that so hey i'm excited oh guys when i'm saying we're unlocking the max potential i'm not joking look at this mastery 600 okay max mastery on dark blade and i don't think i have the upgrade okay let's see items we do not have the star on the dark blade so we have to upgrade it first okay look at this all of my upgraded swords have a star but this one doesn't so before we start anything okay let's see sword what is that we need uh we need like one of these like purple stones what even is that we need 15 of those green bro what are these green stones am i farming emeralds in minecraft or something like what is this and now we need nine magma okay i guess so to get 10 percent extra damage so that will make my dark blade reach its max level okay so that's the only part we need and getting the v3 version which i'll explain right now okay and here we are in the second scene now there is one thing you guys need to know getting dark blade v3 is no joke it can take hours upon hours and wh what is happening with my what the heck? Anyway, Dark Blade V3 is no joke because you guys know how you like collect a uh, Fist of Darkness, like it's the God Chalice of Second C. Well, guess what? To get Dark Blade V3, you actually need two Fist of Darkness. Yes, two, not not one, two of them. And the funny part is, you can't even hold two in your inventory, so one person has to hold one for you. It's so weird. But I guess that's why it's so hard. Okay, so we're gonna go over here and we're gonna roll a fruit first. Okay, let's see. Oh. What the heck? Okay, can I roll a fruit in a chair? I've never done that. Okay, let's see. Oh, <laughs> what the heck? Okay, we got a chop fruit. That's pretty cool. Well, it's not cool. I mean, it was cool that I rolled the fruit in a chair. Okay, yeah, let's store that one. And guys, don't worry. Don't worry. I've done my preparation. Okay, we need two fists of darkness, but this private server right here has been running for exactly four hours. Now, what that basically means is that a fist of darkness is in one of these chests, all right? There's a low percent chance that we get one from this chest, but I'm not gonna collect it because obviously I can't hold two at the same time. So first, we have to do the other way of obtaining another one, which is sea beast. Yeah, yeah, you heard it right. Sea beast, okay? We have to hunt sea beasts down for hopefully not, not long, okay? For hopefully not long to get another Fist of Darkness, and then we have to do a special puzzle, okay? So that's gonna be interesting, okay? But first of all, wait, wait, what's that purple thing? What's that purple, like, uh, like the stone when I tried upgrading my Dark Blade? What is that? Oh, it's called the Dark Fragment. I kind of remember that name. It is a mythical material that can be dropped by Dark Beard. Bro, don't I have to have another Dark of Fistness to, to, like, summon him? There's no way I'm getting three Fists of Darkness in one video, bro. There is no way. How am I even gonna get that? Is that even possible? Bro. Well, at least he has 100% of dropping it. I mean, if that wasn't the case, then I don't know what I would do. Now, guys, I said sell, okay? Because we have to hunt for these sea beasts, okay? And, yeah, I don't know. There's none spawning right now. Huh? I mean, where are they at? And I've done my research. If I go to the wiki right now, it says a Fist of Darkness can be obtained by defeating a sea beast, and it gives five 
90% chance. So, yeah. I'm not really sure I'm gonna get this. If there's literally no CB spawning. Come on, spawn at least. At least give me some chance to get it. Like, what is... Th Wait, what can I see in the distance? This is kind of weird. This is kind of trippy. What the heck? Anyway, where's this stupid CB stat? All right, guys. I've been saving for at least 10 minutes. There's nothing spawning, okay? 10 minutes wasted. Like, wh where's the CBs? There's already no C events that spawn. Like, nothing. Like, I'm just sailing. Like, maybe it spawns when I'm sailing because sitting still, it feels like it's nothing. Bro, is this even ever gonna spawn? Like, what the heck? And a ship rate spawned, okay? Not a sea beast. Well, that's a 50% chance, right? Oh my god, I'm so unlucky. I waited 50 minutes for some stupid ships. Bro, what the? Get out of here. Oh, sea beast spawn, sea beast spawn, sea beast spawn. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This might be it, this might be it. Imagine I get it first try. There's no way if I get it first try. There's actually no way, okay? There's no way. Okay, take some of this CB, stick some of that. Bro, how much HP does he have? 100k? Okay, easy. Magma OP, bro. Magma OP. Okay, there you go. Fly in the... Oh, chill, bro. Okay, there you go. Easy, bro. Easy, easy. Come on, how much? Okay, half HP already. Boom. Okay, wait. That did not hit him. That did not hit him. Okay, there you go. Some of this. Yo, 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 chill. Chill, 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 chill. Okay, magma shower. That should do a lot of... That. Look at that damage, bro. Look at that magma... Yo, chill, bro. Almost dead. It's FIFA Awaken. There you go. Let's jump up. There you go. And now... Let's see, he's 1 HP, okay? He's 1 HP. Boom. And we didn't get it. Yeah, yeah. We, we didn't get it. Okay, that's... Awesome, awesome. Okay, this is gonna take a while, I think. Um, bro, I'm exposing Govi4. Like, what is this? This is a, just a circle. Like, what? It's just like a little circle. What the heck? I thought it was a cool effect, but like, it's literally just a circle, bro. Exposed. Govi4 exposed, guys. Oh, 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 oh. CB, CB, CB. CB alert, CB alert. Okay, let's see. Let's jump in the water right here. Boom. Okay. Bro. Okay, let me get higher. Let me get higher. Let me get a high ground on you. There you go. Take some of this. Take some of that. Easy. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Take some of this. Take some of that. There you go. Look at that damage stacking up. 40k. 40k, look at that. Bro, magma is just so insane, okay? Bruh. Here we go. Some of that, some of this, take some of that. Bruh. And he goes down. Let me go up again, there we go. Dodge that, there we go. Boom. Some of this, take that, take this, take that. And he's almost dead, okay? Super easy, bruh. Take some of that, there you go. And the boom, come on. And nothing. Uh, yeah. On to the next one. This is gonna take so long. Another CBs, another CBs. Okay, they're spawning in fast. Okay, this is good. This is good. This is good. Okay. Oh, he's going away again. What's going on? Okay. Up. Boom. Take some of that. Take some of this. Bro, he's hiding. He's hiding. Okay, there you go. Take that. Take this. Take that as well. There you go. Easy. Take that. Easy to get damage. Easy, 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 easy. Bro, there you go. Take some of the. Oh, it's lagging. What the heck? And he's gone again, bro. Stupid CBs. Come on. He's already scared, bro. He's already scared, okay? It's that. It's some of this. It's some of that. And you should be dead. You should be dead. Come on. We're not dead yet. What the heck? Okay. P4. Come on. Take this. And. No way. Third CBs. Let's go. Bro, we got it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This didn't even took so long. Yes. Oh my god. Yo, no way. Third C beast? Bro, bro, bro. I must be the luckiest person in life. There's actually no way. No. Okay, I thought it was gonna take a lot of C beast, okay? Maybe like 10 plus, but we already got it. What the heck? Yo. Oh, I might be the luckiest person. So now all we gotta do is get the puzzle done, okay? And we need another person for this. Guys, no, no, no. Bro, I have the Fist of Darkness and I accidentally got this chest and I got it again. But bro, no. Gotta do more CBs, but someone else gotta do them because I, I can have fit. Oh my god, bro. It just disappeared. <laughs> oh my god. Whoa, I accidentally touched it. Oh my. And it was the first chest I picked up. Like, oh. uh, I'm doomed, guys. I'm doomed, okay? There's just no way. All right, guys. It's been a while and I still have my fist of darkness. Okay, it's probably been like two hours, okay? But you know who clutched up, okay? Look at this, all right? Yo, we got star with the fist of darkness. That's what I'm saying, bro. That's what I'm saying. He says, yes, sir. That's what I'm saying, bro. Fine. Finally, yes, okay. I swear to god, this took so long. Like, oh my god. You had to get it from a CBIS, but now you gotta activate it, you know? So I activate it on another place and you activate it on another place. It's gonna be kind of weird. And also, guys, disclaimer: if you wanna obtain this, you actually have to get angel, rabbit, shark, and human races all to V3 stage, which I already have, okay? So if you don't have this, don't even try it, okay? You, you'll be wasting your time. So you have to pretty much have this. And then we need two fists of darkness, one for starting Darkbeard 
Wizard Raid, and then one for opening the door at the graveyard. And then we can finally unlock Dark Blade V3. So all Star has to do is go to the Dark Arena, which is right here. Okay, he's already here. So there is this thing right here where you can insert a fist, as you can see. But once you insert his fist, there is no going back, okay? Then I have to rush to the graveyard to unlock this secret door. All right, as you can see, I'm in the graveyard, and there's this secret door over here. So, okay, Star needs to press it right now. Let's see. All right, Star, press it now. Okay, okay, he's about to press it. He's about to press it. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh, yo! Power of Darkness has been unleashed. And now all we gotta do is go over here, press this button, and... Oh my god. Dark Blade V3. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Yo! Something weird has occurred to your Dark Blade. A new Slayer has been born. Let's go! And Slayer of God title. Oh my god. We got it. We got it. We got What is this door, by the way? Can I go... Wait, we can't go in? We can't even go in to the secret area? Like, what? Bruh, I thought I can go in and there's like a cool scene or something. What the heck? Okay, guys, before we do that, we need to rush to the Dark Arena because Dark Beard is over here. And this guy drops the fragment that we can use to upgrade our Dark Blade. So, uh, let me slice you up with Buddha because, I mean, it's gonna be super easy. This is literally the last part, okay? And then we can finally get the Dark Blade V3 fully maxed out and conquer the whole of Block's Roots. Okay, guys, my recording cut down there, but we defeated Blackbeard and we got the Dark Fragment. But there's still some things that we have to do, which are the remaining materials. And also look at the chat, okay? A new Slayer has been born. New title, Slayer. The Bro, that's insane. Okay, but what are we missing, okay? 1 out of 1 fragment, 5 out of 15, and 1 out of 10 magma. Okay, that shouldn't take too long. But first, we need to take a look at the Dark Blade, okay? So, 3 to 1, boom. Oh, yo! Dark Blade V3 maxed out. Oh, my. this took me so long. This took me so long, by the way. Oh my god. I grinded hours upon hours to even get this item, okay? It, it was no easy job. Now we got it, okay? We also got different abilities like this one. It's all like different. It's white, right? So, okay, okay. It's I, I guess it's kind of cool. I mean, all the grinding for a visual effect. But we still gotta upgrade our sword, though. So, it's not a max potential. So, yeah, this is like all white, which is pretty cool. But it's not max level yet, okay? We need to upgrade the sword. But for that, we have to go to two different locations. Hydra Island and C1. So, first, I guess we go to C3. And apparently, there's these NPCs right here. The Dragon Kree Warrior. That we can fight for these materials. Let's see. Can we get it fast, though? Because we need 10 of these. There is one. Nine more left to go. Okay, there you go. After like 15 minutes of grinding, we got 16 uh, dragon scales. So now, all we need to do is go to Port Town and head over to C1, where we can get the magma. All right, we arrived. And all we have to do is fight these military spies to give their information. Or magma ores, I mean. Give me all your ores, okay? Okay, there you go. That's the first one. Now, eight more to go. Oh, that should be enough. And let's see. 11. Okay, easy. We got enough, okay? 11 Magma Ores. Now, all we have to do is go to the nearest blacksmith to get the V3 version. Oh, my God. I'm pretty sure that's at Pirate Village. Where are you at, blacksmith? I need to get my final upgrade. We've upgraded the Dark Blade to V2, V3, and now it's gonna be the Max Potential. Max Upgrade Sword, okay? 1 out of 1 Dark Fragment, 60. Okay, we got enough for 10% extra damage. Before we do that, though, how much damage is it dealing now, okay? Let's go reef on the stats and put everything on the sword. And now let's see. It's doing 3k damage per slashed, which is pretty insane already. Now all we gotta do is go talk to the blacksmith, upgrade my sword, craft. There you go. Upgrade a weapon to grade one. And now we have the max level dark bait. Mastery 600, max damage, the best accessory, and it does... 3.26 damage. Rather, 3,260 damage, okay? Insane. We have finally unlocked the true potential of the Dark Blade, okay? Oh my god. Wait, how much do the abilities do nowadays? Let's see. Uh, 500? Wait. 6 stop. What? Uh, bruh? Like that? Okay, this one does 500 for some reason. But the second ability, bro... 6k okay 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 dark blade is insane guys this took me a very long time to record so please drop a like i have been grinding in the second c for the last couple of days because i had a mission okay a mission for a big purpose and this was to become one of the best swordsmen alive now the grind was hard the grind was long but after all that hard grinding we unlocked the sadi the she sweet and the wano sword to unlock the final sword yes okay you guys know where i'm going okay today we're gonna be unlocking the true triple katana in block shoots finally 
me. Now it took a while, okay? Don't get me wrong. And these swords were insanely fun to test out, okay? Some of these abilities were really fun. Especially this last one, okay? But guys, today we're gonna be unlocking the true triple katana and uh, to be honest, I have no clue how to get it, okay? I've never even known where to get it because now I have every single three swords, but I didn't get the sword. Once you get a Sadi, Sishui, and Wando to mastery 350 or 300, you're now allowed to buy it. But where that is, I have absolutely no, no clue. Yeah, I have absolutely no clue. Now, before I unlock this sword, I want to have the fitting clothes when unlocking a sword because as you know, the character that unlocks the true triple katana is obviously Zoro. Uh, and that's much better, okay? We are Zoro and we're gonna become the ultimate Zoro. But first, we obviously need to get a sword. We only have the Sadi over here and look what we got over here. Star, are you ready? We're gonna be unlocking the true triple katana, all right? And your dual curse katana, I, I don't know. Okay, may maybe the true triple is not gonna be better. What happened to your hair? Well, I became Zoro, okay? I, I painted it, okay? So we're gonna be unlocking this and I actually have no clue how to get this. You look like the Joker. Well, yeah, it's kind of, kind of, you know, kind of. It doesn't matter, okay? We're gonna become the best swordsman. So, we first need to roll fruit, okay? That's what every best swordsman does, okay? Everybody rolls a fruit. And if you're not rolling fruits, then what are you doing? Okay, let's see. 300k for a, f a flame fruit. It's like... Bro, block shoots. Bless me one time, okay? Yeah, you can you can have it, bro. I don't, I don't even want to store it, okay? And you got a wait, you got a magma fruit? Wow, magma is surprisingly good, but not a mythical or legendary. So who cares? Now I have only gotten one tip about this true triple katana, okay? I can literally buy it, but I have to know the location of the dealer, and I have gotten the location. So it's green zone. It's somewhere in the green zone. I mean, a green zone is a place full of plants. Where can you even find this guy? I'm surely not on the bottom, okay? Stars already. Wait, what are you doing here? This guy's teleporting, but still, we need to find. This guy, where is this guy? And the gorns aren't even fitting either. But the mink airs are bro. What is the mink? What are the mink airs doing on your back? Um, wait, I think he's hiding on the top of the finds. Wait, really? You say the top, so you mean all the way to the top? Uh, how do we get there? Because we can't portal up there. Wait, hold on, Dude, there's no way anyone get there. Okay, portal is gonna make it a lot easier, obviously. But how did he get there? Okay, how did a sword dealer get there? Hold on, we need to get all the way up here. There you go, mom plant, save me. Okay, there you go. No, I'm falling off. I'm falling off. No, 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 this is bad. Okay, so we can only stand like at the leaves. Is it that one? Is it that? I think it's the biggest one. It has to be the biggest one. This must be the highest point in a whole second C. Let's see. Come on, bro. I can't even. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, I saved myself. Oh, 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 wait, no. This is hard. This is hard. I'm, I'm sliding off. Come on. Here we go. Now, one more try. One more try. Come on. Oh, this is hard. Okay. I got it. Okay, we're finally here. And we're going to the last... Oh, I think I see someone. Wait. All right, Star, you're cheating with light fruit, okay? But what is this mysterious man? How did you get up here, buddy? And wait, with that belly? Bro, how did this guy get up here? He's way too heavy to get up here. What the heck? He's a pirate. Yeah, what do you mean? Oh, he does have a pirate helm. Okay, that's pretty cool. But I don't really care, okay? I'm here to claim something, okay? Hey. Hello, fellow swordsman. It appears you have mastered all the legendary swords. Yes, sir, that's right. Do you wish to learn the true triple cat? Tana style for 2 million. Wait, 2 million? To be honest, I thought it's gonna be more, okay? But it's the same as any other legendary. He ate all the mythical fruits. Look at his belly. Yeah, I, I know. He ate all of them, bro. What the heck? That's where the mythical fruits have been, okay? Uh, anyway, let's go and buy this one, okay? And there you go, okay? Obtained the true triple katana. For 2 million. That's actually cheaper than I expected, to be honest. I, I thought we were gonna pay like 5 million. So I'm completely good with that. Anyway, where is this thing at? Come on. I have been grinding for so long. Where is this thing? Come on, it should be somewhere over here and and, oh, I think I see it. A true triple katana. Look at that. And we got it. Okay, equip. New title, Demon Eye and the Hurricane. You can say so. Oh, look at that. We finally unlocked the true triple katana. And that means we have one sword in my in my mouth. What, what the heck? And guys, did you know this is one of the three swords you can get as a three sword style? We get the triple katana, this one, and the triple yoru. But obviously the triple yoru is not obtainable. But this is looking sick. This is the best triple katana you can obtain. And how much? damage does it do? 1.9? Um... I know why, I know why. I don't have Bell Scarf on, so I have to get that on for an extra 15% damage. And if I turn hockey on, bro, just take a look at this. This looks overpowered. Now, guys, we still need to unlock the first move, which is Wolf Fang Rush, and the second one, which is Dragon Hurricane, which is 350 mastery, okay? That's gonna be a grind. And then after that, we're gonna try to beat the best boss out of the entire game to see if we got all the powers. Now, to be honest, I don't know which one looks better okay the curse duel looks cool because it's like one static color look at the triple one okay i think this one looks crazy now let's see with pulse carbon let's see how much damage 
2. Oh, 2.5k. That's insane. Wait a minute. Usually swords do 2.3k, but this one is actually really good. And we're gonna be obviously upgrading the swords so we can even get more OP. But first, we need to go to the third seat to even master this sword, okay? Oh, look at this. This looks insane. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Look at the three swords on me, okay? We got a Sishui, Mwando, and the Sadi in one. This is so sick. And a boom. We're in the third seat, and look at that. Look who we got here. A homeless skeleton guy. Or should I say, one of the best swordsmen in the third seat? Well, today, there's an end to it, okay? I became the best swordsman, okay? And first of all, before I do anything, I need to check this, okay? I do this with almost every sword, but with this one, it's gonna look so cursed, I feel like. Let's see. Oh my god, bro. The Buddha glitch with... What the heck? Bro, this looks so cursed. I don't even know what to say. But it looks crazy, okay? But first, we need to beat this guy up, okay? Come here, Longma. I'm gonna slash you up, okay? I have the true triple katana, okay? You're not gonna escape from this one, buddy. Yeah, you're not gonna... Okay, this is kinda unfair, okay? I'm gonna make it fair. I'm gonna fight like a real man over here and uh, see if I can be... Oh, wait. The, the style... Wait, wait. Did you guys see that? Like, the slash things? The effects are insane. And I'm getting slashed up, okay? I need to focus up. Focus up, okay? Focus up. I'm the best swordsman, okay? I can't be losing against this skeleton guy. Okay, come on. No, 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 no. Okay? Come on, but Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. You can die already. And there you go, okay? Police. At least give me some mastery. Like, 150, 140. I don't care, okay? Just give me enough. Wait a minute. 137? I usually get 142. Wait. Mythical swords require more mastery? What? I guess that makes sense. But now I'm pretty sure these fishmen can't give me enough, okay? Let's see. Let's slash you up, buddy. Yeah, let's slash you up. Double sword style. And that's three levels, okay? I need to just slash these fishmen up, and we're gonna be Gucci. That's another three levels. And that's another two. And another two. Come on, the last one come on and there you go new skill available and we finally locked it the first ability on the true triple katana which is wolf fang rush now what is this supposed to do star where are you at i need to test this thing but how much damage is this gonna do okay i'm pretty excited all right let's see this thing is it any op let's see three two one come on 4.1 thousand, but I didn't really see what happens. So I slash through you like the Sishui, I guess. That's what I'm guessing, okay? Let's go and try like this. Let's see. Oh, yeah, so it's like the Sishui, but it's way bigger range, and it looks pretty cool. Now, keep in mind, we still need to upgrade a sword, so that wasn't everything. And obviously, we need to unlock Dragon Hurricane, which is 350 Mashu, which is a lot, okay? okay? How much does one slash do now? Let's see. 2.6k, okay, we're going on to the bigger, like, numbers, which is very good. Anyway, let's see if we can upgrade the sword before we start even grinding for 350 mastery. Because I know, well, that's gonna be a pain. Let's see, come on. Ooh, oh, okay, so we need only two of this, like, Mystic Droplets, and I'm pretty sure we have to go back to the second C for that. And then we can get an upgrade of 15%. Wait, that looks amazing. All right, here we are on Sko Island. With our true triple katana, because we have a mission here, okay? We need to get some materials, okay? I've been here way too many times. Oh, and there is one. Okay, I've never gotten one so quickly. There you go. One more to go. I'm not going to lie. This is one of the coolest swords I've ever used, okay? Look at the three swords style. Like, this is insane. Even though I'm only slashing with two swords and the other one is just in my mouth. I don't know. But it still looks decent. And there you go. The last one. Mystic Droplet. And now we can go ahead and upgrade this sword. All right, and here we are, okay? Blacksmith, I got a quest for you, okay? We have to upgrade my true triple katana. And there you go. We got everything. Craft. And we upgrade our sword. I'm pretty sure we did like... Wait. Uh, what is up with my sword? Why is hockey on one sword and not on the others? This this is so weird. What? Anyway, so we need to test the damage. Let's see. What is one slash now? 3,000 watts. That is insane. And we still need to get 350 mastery, which is gonna get the damage up a lot more. Wait, wait. How much is the Z ability? Let's see. 4.8 thousand. Wait. It's getting a lot more damage. What the heck? This is good. But now back to grinding, because we need to do a lot more. And we're gonna start off by defeating K-Queen. All right, K-Queen, take some of this true triple katana, right? Take some of this, buddy. Yeah, you're about to die. And you know what? To make it a little bit fairer, I'm gonna get my big swords out, so I can actually defeat you. Get on my mastery, okay? I need a lot more mastery right now, so let me slash you up, okay? Let me slash you up. Come here, buddy. Take some of this. Ooh, okay. Okay, chill, buddy. Chill, buddy. Take some of this, and you're gonna be dead within moments. I'm on one HP, and give me your mastery. There you go. And that got us up to 200 mastery. Well, that's not even close to 350, so we need a few more K-Queens then, okay? But obviously, we're gonna switch it up with Longma as well, because K-Queen is gonna get boring, okay? So we need to get this guy down, okay? Come on. He's already 1 HP. This guy is so weak, okay? This is supposed to be the greatest swordsman, like what? Well, there you go, okay? 218 mastery. And now we have to rinse and repeat. Okay, buddy, go ahead and die. There you go. Another one down. Let's see. That's gonna give us 238. Like 100 more mastery to go. Uh, this is gonna take a while. 
Okay, long man, what's up? I need to kill you once again, okay? And there we go, you're gonna be dead in a second right here. Boom, easy. And we got up to 280, okay? It's going slower and slower. All right, there you go, she's dead again, and we got up to 300. So now, 50 more to go. So we're gonna go visit long man once again. What's up, buddy? Time to die for you as well. Okay, slash you up like that, bro. There's no way, okay? He has no chance, okay? It's not fair, okay? Okay, I'm gonna use my normal blades. I mean, what am I saying, to be honest? This is not even fair with the normal blades for him, okay? He's gonna die either way, okay? Take some of this, buddy. Real, true, triple katana, okay? Take some of this, and you're dead, buddy. You're dead. All right, go ahead and die again. Let's see, come on. 341. That means we need nine more mastery, and then we finally lock the last ability, which that is exciting. Let's see if Longma is gonna give us enough. Come here, Longma. There's only place for one swordsman to be alive, okay? And that's me, okay? So you're gonna die, okay, buddy? Take some of this. The true triple katana powers. Man, get your Tushita out of here, okay? The Tushita is long, not better than this one, okay? So take some of this and die. Come on. There you go. You're dead. And you gave me not even enough. So it wasn't even worth fighting you. We still need three more mastery. Get these fishmen out of my way, okay? Take some of this, buddy. And go ahead and die. Come on, is that enough? Come on. And there you go. New skill available. We finally unlocked a Dragon Hurricane, okay? This 350 mastery style move. The best move for the true triple katana. And the star is on time, okay? Let's see what the true powers are, okay? And after that, I'm gonna attempt to fight one of the hardest bosses in the game that I've prepared for a long time to fight, okay? With these true triple katanas. Because I've heard that boss is really strong. But anyway, let's go and try it out, okay? Three, two, one. Oh my... What the heck? I just sent you into a hurricane. What? That is insane. It kind of looks like an outdated move, to be honest, but OMG. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Wait, the true trip katanas are insane. So you can just like do that and just put someone in a hurricane. What? Wait, that is sick. It looks so cool. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, bro, I can just put anyone in a hurricane. Like, look at this. Like, boom. Yo, this must be one of the coolest attack I've seen in block shoots. Yeah, this is sick. And it does good damage. Like, what? Wait, what is the slashing damage again? Let's see. 3.2k. Yeah, that's amazing. But now, guys, I need to try these swords on one boss. That is one of the strongest bosses in the entire game. Not many attempt to fight him alone, but I'm gonna do it. Okay, here we are. The beautiful pirate domain. And here's the pirate, okay? He is one of the strongest swordsmen. As you can see, he has a sword. Now, he does have a lower level than Longma, you would say. But he's still one of the strongest ones since he can awaken. And let me tell you what I mean, okay? Let's slash him up like that, okay? Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Take some of this true triple... Okay, he's doing hide. Oh my god, look at my HP, bro. Oh my god. Dude, this boss is insane. What the heck? I'm already half HP. Okay, wait, wait. Take some of this, buddy. Take some of this hurricane, okay? There you go. Take some of that. That's what I thought. What you gonna do now? Okay, okay. Oh, he hit that. What the heck? Okay, take some of this. Come on. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. There you go. Now, guys, this is not the reason this boss is hard, okay? This guy can transform into a second form, okay? And he's probably gonna be soon, okay? So I need to be alert on every single second, okay? If he transforms, it's over for me. And there you go. Oh my god. Second face. Look at him glow. Now I need to be really careful. Okay, wait, wait. I'm super low. Wait, wait, wait. I need to run away. Oh my god, this guy is hitting everything. I'm 1k HP. What? Take some of this, buddy. Take some of the dragon hurricane, okay? There you go. Oh no, I've aggroed him even more. Okay, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Run, run, run. He missed that. Okay. Take some of this, buddy. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, this boss is harder than expected. What the heck? Okay. Take some of this. Take some of the hurricane. He's so tanky. He's way more tankier than Longma. Like, that's what I'm saying. This boss is the strongest swordsman. If we are able to kill him, then we take the trophy of becoming the strongest swordsman. Okay. So, come on. Die, buddy. Die, buddy. I know I'm stronger. I just know I'm stronger. Okay. Take some of this. There you go. There's no way this guy is stronger than me. Okay. Take some of that. There you go. My preparation took days upon days upon weeks. I'm not gonna let this preparation go to waste. I've unlocked all the legendary swords just to be this guy. Okay. I'm not gonna let it wait to wait. Oh, he's fast. He's fast. He's fast. Chill, 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 chill. Take some of that. Boom. No, he's fast. Oh, he's too fast. I don't want to feed for transform because that's going to be unfair. So I'm just going to run. Come on, run away. Run away. Okay, he's super low. He's super low. Come on. Some attacks will finish him off. Okay, no, no, no. Chill. Take some of this hurricane. There you go. Bro, I'm super close to dying. Okay, this is bad. This is bad. He's also super close, but I'm also super close. Okay, this is no good. He's long distance good. Come on. I'm pretty sure it's one HP. Come on, take some of this. See that? Oh my god, no. Look at my HP. 2k HP, bro. He's one shot. I'm one shot. This is bad. Okay, I dodged it. I dodged it. Now, die. <gasps> we defeated him. Boom. And that's how I became the strongest swordsman in the entire of block shoots. Just look at me, all right? Today, we're mastering one of the mythical swords in block shoots. And there's a total of five mythical swords in block shoots, okay? We got Hell Sight, we got the Curse of Katana, True Triple Katana, Dark Blade, and the Triple Dark Blade. Now, you guys obviously know from the thumbnail, from the title, we are becoming a Reaper today, okay? As you can see, we have the Hallow Scythe over here. Yeah, 
right here this bad boy and this is the only scythe in the game and we're gonna be mastering this all the way up and testing its potential okay and look how sick this looks dude okay it's actually amazing and they say that this is a alternative to the cursed duo katana which i also don't have i'm pretty sure star has that one yeah look at that he has that one look the cursed duo katana but, Star, are you ready? We're gonna be mastering the Hallow side today, okay? And you don't even have this sword, do you? No? Yeah, that's exactly what I thought, because this is the hardest sword to unlock in the third C, all right? I mean, in the game, this is the rarest sword, okay? It is a 5% drop chance from a special boss, okay? Let me show you around. If we go over to the haunted castle right over here, and if we go over here to the graveyard, right? Um, If you go over to this guy over here, there's a small chance that you get it, okay? Let's see. Please? Pray? Oh, no, no. No, no, wait, wait, see? Please, pray, please. There's like 1%. Oh, nothing. Oh, yeah, it's not night. Oh, wait, I, I forgot. You have to do it in the night. I'm stupid, right? But we're gonna go over here, and this Death King over here is the guy you have to have, right? This is the guy, this is the guy that's gonna give you the special item, the special item that you'll need, okay? I have 3.5k bones because I've been saving up, okay? I plan to get a curse to a katana, but I guess we can do a test spin, okay? And we just got 10 minutes of 2 times EXP. But there's a small chance that you can get a hollow essence, right? And with that hollow essence, you can summon a boss. You do that right over here on this weird like fiery thing. I don't I don't even know what this is to be honest, but yeah, you do it over here, okay? You smash it over here and then you have to go over here. Yes, so right here, if you go over this bridge over here, you can go right up to this like room. Yeah, this this crazy open room. And as you can see, there's nobody here. But if you spawn the hollow essence with that like weird ritual thing, there is a soul reaper that will spawn here. And after you've done all those things, uh yeah, it, it's not it's not guaranteed that you get it, okay? There's a 5% chance that you get this hello side okay so it's super rare but as you can see we have it right so we're gonna be mastering this sword and uh, a lot of you guys probably don't have this okay what do you mean it took you a while yeah it took me a while actually like it's it's been a few bosses for sure so we have to get this sword all the way up to mastery 350 to get soul execution right so we need to get started okay and there's also a way to upgrade this thing by the way okay so i'm gonna have to show you that okay if we go over to port town let's see do we have enough for upgrade oh blacksmith okay there you are okay upgrade my weapon please okay let's see can we even upgrade it how many things do oh oh easy wait 50 okay we got 50 of these we got 3k bones we need 800 bones and we need 70 scrap metal okay we, we have everything okay 10 percent extra damage i mean i'll take it okay let's go and craft that one and there you go we upgrade our weapon i didn't test the damage though okay that was uh that's kind of a waste so now we'll never know the base damage i mean uh where's star actually let's go to mansion right here is he here all right there you are okay let's see so we have an upgraded hollow side okay and let's go and check it out okay let's see oh yeah that's okay yeah 30 damage guys yeah there's something wrong with my stats okay let's see <laughs> i need to refund it all right that should be better okay sword and now come on let's see how much come on 2.4 k um wait a minute i've seen swords that do way better damage than that like at least 2.6 k like the canfender okay uh, bro what is 2.4 thousand that is not much what is that and it is upgraded bro it's starting off pretty bad i'm gonna keep it a buck okay but we're gonna go and find a boss and we're gonna get the first ability right maybe it's not about the damage okay let's see i guess you can spam it wait let's see oh what the heck wait wait Oh my- Wait, I'm spamming it super quickly. Oh, check this out, guys. I went on the wiki and look at this. Insanely fast M1 click, okay? Attacks, which makes it extremely good for grinding with Buddha. Makes sense. Makes and low cooldown. Okay, we, we have to test that out. All right, Longma. I came here to welcome you to my new site, all right? You're about to die, buddy, okay? Prepare for death. I plan to slice, 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 and dice you up, all right? So take some of this. Take some of my, um, okay, Talon. Here we go. Boom. All right. I may not be doing a lot of damage, but my slashes are quick, alright? My slashes are whenever you don't expect it, alright? So, oh, he's almost killing me, though. But no chance, alright? No chance, alright? There you go. We got a long mat dead, and let's see. How much mastery will we get, okay? 70, 80, 90, please. Give me at least, like, 140. I'm pretty sure this boss gets 140. Let's see, please. Alright, mastery 136. So now we get 40 more, and then we can get Death Cyclone. All right, we're gonna go over here and we're gonna take a visit on Mr. Big Mom, eh? What's up? What's up? I'm here to slice you and dice you up, all right? So you make no chance, right? Take some of this. Okay, maybe I can actually slice you up or something, but as the wiki said, it's best used with Buddha. So let's go and use the Buddha and let's see. Come on. Can I slice you? It's going super fast, okay? My M1s are actually super quick. It is amazing. 
Hi, big mom. Come here. Come here. Oh, oh, yo, yo, chill. Okay, my observation is broken. Okay, she's about to kill me. Like, chill, right? Chill for once in your life. Like, okay, here we go. Come on. Come on. Hey, there you go. Let's go. New skill available. Okay, we got it. The Death Cyclone. Hey, and we got up to 183 mastery. That's not even bad, okay? Let's go try it out. All right, first ability of a mythical sword. I'm expecting something crazy, something out of this world, okay? And it said it was the same as Curse Duel, so we're see. I mean, I've never used it, to be honest. So, let's see. Three, two, one, and... Okay. Oh, what the... Wait, that's insane. Wait, is that the same as Curse Duel? Oh, it is. It's just a different version of that. Wait, that's actually pretty interesting, but mine looks way cooler, okay? Hey, I'm, I'm gonna have to admit, bro. You have to admit, okay? Mine looks way better. Look at that. Did you use yours real quick? I mean, it's kind of hard to compare because you have all, like, electricity and stuff, but I have, like, some crazy, like, hollow stuff and stuff. Yeah, I don't know, but mine looks really sick. I think this one looks better, to be honest, okay? Hey, what, what you trying, bro? What you trying, okay? It's not this, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm not disappointed on the first move, but still, we have another one to unlock, which is Soul Execution, okay? This one is 350 mastery, so yeah, Big Mom, I have to, like, uh, execute you a few times to get this execution move, alright? I hope you don't mind. Okay, guys, we were grinding, but look at this. Fruit Detect, okay? So we gotta get this fruit, okay? So let's see, um, where is it? 1,000 meters? Um, uh, is it Sea Castle? I don't think... Bro, there's no fruits that spawn there, okay? I, I don't believe in it, okay? It might be that side. Giant Tree is not 1000, okay? I think it's turtle. I think it's turtle. Let's see. Turtle Mansion. Hey, as I thought, as I thought. Don't mind if I do. Okay, where's this fruit? Wait. And it's a flame fruit, okay? Yeah, that's uh, that's disappointing, to be honest. That's just, that's a waste of time. Here, you take it, okay? You take it. <laughs> there you go. I want no flame fruits. All right, guys, we go back to grinding. All right, guys, it's been a while, and as you can see, look at my mastery, right? 335, okay? So a few more big moms, and it should be all right. Wait. She already has one HP. Let's see. How much is that gonna do? 5.3k, bro, that's insane damage, okay, and with my slashes, she's dead, right, okay, one more, actually, 343, and then we'll finally unlock soul execution, okay, I'm excited, bro, I hope the last move is even more damage, okay, so take some of this, buddy, yeah, that's what I thought, right, that's what I thought, all right, Buddha transform, bro, two Buddhas against the big mom, bro, it's literally no chance for her, okay, no chance, like, Kei Queen, you can do all your abilities, okay? Instinct breaks, okay? Knockbacks, whatever you want to do. But at the end of the day, you're so weak, all right? You're so weak. Hey, chill, man. You get that? Here we go. Come on. Okay, no, bro. What is that beam, bro? Okay, come on. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. And new skill available. Hey, let's go, okay? We got soul execution finally, bro. Let's go test it out, all right? Let's see if it's any good. This is the moment, right? Soul execution, the best ability of a mythical sword. The rarest sword in the entire game. All right, guys, here it is, all right? Three, two, one. Oh, what is that? I'm flying. What the heck? Okay, see? Oh, what? Hey, yo, that was insane. Wait, wait, I, I guess I can't combo that because, like, this one knocks you back. So, let's gonna try it again. So, I'm flying at first, okay? And then I take you with me. Oh, yo, that is insane, though. So, I fly in you, I take you in the sky, and then I slash you, bro. That is crazy. Wait a minute, from how far can I do it, though? Like, can I do it from this far? Let's see. Oh, even from this, and this slash looks insane. Yeah, this is amazing. I think it does pretty much the same damage as that Cyclone. Let's see. Oh, no, yeah, that Cyclone is way better. 5,000, okay? Yeah, that Cyclone is insane. And then if you combo that, yeah, that might be insane, okay? But you can't really because you knock back on every ability. So, yeah. But, guys, Hello Sight is insane, okay? It is literally a second version of a Cursed Duo Katana. And it looks sick, okay? Look at this, okay? Yeah, yeah, my, my sight is way better, okay? Look at that, Look at that, man. Look at the drip on the... Like, look how I'm holding it, bro. Like, hey, that says enough, all right? Anyways, guys, like and subscribe or... You're never gonna get this sword. You're never gonna get this sword, okay? See ya.